Hey! Welcome back to No Engines, No Tomatoes. Jen and Christina at your service. Hi. Hey. Hi, boys and girls. <laughs> hey, we're getting ready to uh, recap the, uh, the Michigan race in the Irish Hills. But, and well, since we're doing that, we're going we're gonna to take a moment and we are going to honor uh, Queen of Soul. the Queen of Soul. The life of um, Aretha Franklin. That's right. Uh, passed away yesterday at the age of 76. Um, an icon. I was raised on her. My my memories of her are my mom playing her her gospel album on Sundays in the morning. Right, you wake up, you wake up to Aretha Franklin singing "Mary, Don't You Weep," and and you get and you get your day started. Wonderful, iconic. What do you? What, well, you know, I'm, I'm a heathen, and so <laughs> um, I, I know her from respect, and um, I love the George Michael, Aretha Franklin duet, Knew you were waiting for me. Yes, it, it, it was a great song by, by two icons who unfortunately both, both are, gone. are gone. And then, uh, you know, uh, don't want to offend anybody, but I'm going to mention it, um, the different world thing. It's a different world than where, where you come, come from. from. I mean, she is okay, everything. Right. And listen, it's not far-fetched to say that she's maybe the greatest female vocalist of all time. Cross, cross genres. Let's put, put your chips in and see who else you can come up Roll with. Roll them up with. But hey, um, rest in peace. Uh, prayers with the family. Let's move on. All right, what Michigan. we got going on? So we did not see the Michigan race live. We nope. were listening to part of it in the car as we were driving home from Chicago. And then we watched a little bit of it on DVR. Yep. And so I'm sure, I'm sure a different, sure driver, a, a different driver won. Other than who? Other than the big three. Other than, well, let me see, other than uh, I'm Truex, sure. Kyle Busch, Kevin Harvick won. That's, Kevin Harvick won? <laughs> Kevin Harvick, <laughs> Kevin Harvick dominates this race. I Let's look at this. Let, let me look. I'm, I'm gonna look. I'm gonna pull this away. Kevin Harvick wins stage one, stage two, and is the race winner. Hmm. Oh my gosh! All right, and he also took the um, the takes the lead in the playoff points. Oh my gosh! So holy crap! What that's happened? his seventh win. That is his seventh win, and oh my gosh! And so here's the deal too, right? If you look look back at this race, what I want to say, poor Fox again. NBC has lucked into every race they've had has been exciting, including this one. We were again, we were listening to it on XM, and we were like, oh my goodness, there were cautions, there were lead changes, and there were wrecks, there were, there were all kind of different things happening. To give a little insight, yeah. we're listening to the race on Sarah. But Sir, then we sexy. had uh, our phone up, and I'm watching, giving Jed play-by-play -play of the PGA Championship as Tiger Woods just refuses to hit the ball into the fairway. He, he didn't hit a fairway in his first, in the first nine holes. Don't, so we're doing we both. We can't get off topic. Okay. But I started speeding so we could get home. Yes. So anyway, so Kevin freaking Harvick. So now he has 40 Playoff points to Kyle 35. 35. Now Kyle still leads the total points over Harvick with 62. By 62 points. But Harvick's Harvick's theory is this. What's his theory? His theory is to I'm just gonna win all these races to negate Kyle Bush's um if he does win the regular season, those 15 points. However, regardless. Those two are, are going to go in with a huge lead going into the playoffs. Yeah, so Harvick with seven, Kyle with six, and then Truex with four. Yeah. And so, with Michigan, we have... Who finished second? Finally! Hey, where are you at? Brad K. Brad K. thank you for showing up to the party. Who? Um, anyway, so he comes in second. Kyle Busch comes in third, so Harvick doesn't get a big point lead over him. Mm -hmm. Austin Dillon fourth, Ryan Blaney fifth, Kurt Busch sixth, Eric Amarola seventh, Hamlin eighth, Chase Elliott ninth, and Logano tenth. Yeah, how about that? It was, it, was, it, was a, it was a nice little mix. And then, but I will say this: what? 14th place, Martin Truex. He 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 had some issues. He didn't he didn't run very well, 
And uh, but it really doesn't matter that much. Not that much. Because we're not gonna race a two mile track when we go into the chase. But I know he he would want to be better than that. Yes. And so Woo. then the points remain: Kyle Busch with the lead, Harvick second, Truex third, Kurt Busch fourth, Boyer fifth, Logano sixth, Brad K seventh, Ryan Blaney eighth, Denny Hamlin ninth, Kyle Larson tenth. The only people that you would roll up in front of those guys would be Chase Elliott, of course, because he has a win now, and then also Austin Dillon, who's sitting down in 20th place, but is in the chase. That's right. And so only 16 players, we talked about all these playoff points, only 16 drivers actually have a playoff point, right. and not all of them will be in the uh, playoffs. We have three races left. We have three late races left, and we're just going to see if anybody else anybody else can win to get in i don't know i just i i i i, I just don't know this weekend maybe at, at bristol but kyle bush this has been his home we'll talk about that in the other podcast but hey is there anything else we want to talk about other uh, about michigan are we good i think we're good okay is there anything do, 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 hey, you want to hit one of these subjects want to hit airline well, let's do this one all right so look pringles Pringles chips. Let them, this will be a five-minute tirade. I don't understand why Pringles have, hasn't dominated the world, taken over the chip world. It's the greatest thing. <laughs> like, listen, I'm a neat eater, okay? I <laughs> love not. my I love my food neat. And to be able to open up a tube and then pull out a perfectly shaped chip and put it in my mouth... Magical. He wants every other chip to be banned. Um, if, in, if, if in, unless, not, unless, unless they put it in a tube. Doritos, you have to stack your little triangles up in a tube. Yep. I think Lay's and them do have a tubed product. But they're just not as tasty as Pringles. Ugh. Okay. So he wants, right. uh, he wants Pringles to take over the world. Cheetos, I don't know what you're going to do. Horse chips, what about my Fritos? I like Fritos. Do you want to make... They can go three across and then up top like Jenga, and then I then I may be able to pull them out. He's ridiculous sometimes about his rants and. Uh, I'm just saying, and you know what? And Cheetos, guess what? Cheetos needs need, needs to serve their 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 um their they need to include surgical gloves, so I don't get all this stuff on my cause my fingers. Because I know some of you guys like licking your fingers, but it's it's freaking disgusting, right? I like to eat Cheetos and then go to the dentist. Of course you do. Say, so go ahead, get, That's that, an old get one. that out. That's an old one. Listen, cutting it off. Thank you for tuning in. Make sure, make, hey, make sure you guys follow us. Like us. Like subscribe. us. Subscribe. Subscribe, tweet, all that good old stuff. All right. We're pretty cool. Well, next one will be a Bristol. Pre Ooh, Bristol, baby. Baby.